بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على سيد المرسلين سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Brothers and sisters, this is Imam Zay Shakir, and I'm here to talk to you about something very, very important, and that's an ongoing, it's already started, series of mobilizations sponsored by the Afia Foundation and many, many uh, allies under the leadership of Maurice Salakhan to petition and elicit, to urge, to literally beg for support for Afia Siddiqui, a young Pakistani scientist, a woman who was kidnapped in front of her home, separated from her young children, uh, taken into prison after prison across international borders, tortured, and if one would be uh, shot, literally shot, uh, tortured, and if one would deny physical torture, uh, exposed to psychological torture that has really uh, crushed her almost. Uh, Hafiz of Quran, a uh, honor graduate, a graduate with honors, PhD from MIT, a uh, graduate of Brandeis University, someone during a time here in the United States very active uh, with various organizations to help people understand Islam as a, as a peaceful religion that encourages the respect for the law. This sister is undergoing an or ordeal that would break the strongest of men. And she hasn't broken yet, brothers and sisters, but she's very close to it. She needs support. She's physically ill. Uh, she's not receiving proper medical treatment, uh, to my knowledge. And we need to really come together. We need to encourage each other. We need to support her. And we need to support organized efforts to uh, at least get her extradited to a country of, of origin. So which is Pakistan. So brothers and sisters, this isn't just part of a national effort. This is an international effort. It's going on in Great Britain and other European countries. It's going on uh, in Pakistan. It's going on in many different places uh, in the uh, Scandinavian countries. But your support is needed, brothers and sisters. We're here in the most powerful nation on earth. And what happens here has a tremendous impact and effect all over the world. So I'm encouraging, encouraging you to get involved. You can go to the AFIA Foundation, A-A-F-I-A -A Foundation, for more information on these mobilizations, the time, the place, the dates that they're occurring. As I said, they're already ongoing. Uh, but they're coming to a, a city near you, inshallah, a region near you, and hopefully... You can get yourself there. You can get your friends and families there. I'm going to try to make sure I attend at least one or two of these. May Allah Ta'ala give her uh, strength. May Allah Ta'ala bless her. May Allah Ta'ala bless her to draw on the reserves of the Quran as a hafida that she possesses to help her get through this ordeal. And may Allah Ta'ala bless us to do everything in our power to assist her. This is Imam Zay Shakir urging your support for Dr. Afia Siddiqui and supporting the effort led by Maurice Salakhan and the Afia Foundation to gain her release. So again, go to their website for more information. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.